already. Uh, so I'm going to start with a prayer. Thank you, God, for this wonderful day you've given us. Thank you for our togetherness here tonight. Thank you for the great preaching we've had so far. Please let that continue. And please be with me as I deliver your word. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 All right. Let's look at uh, John 5, 24. That's good. Okay. <clears throat> Jesus is speaking here. Verily, verily, I say unto you, he that heareth my colors, is that what it says? <laughs> <laughs> no, he that heareth my word, and believeth on him that sent me, hath everlasting life, and shall not come into condemnation, but is passed from death unto life. That's good. Alright, uh, Psalms 12, 6. We already looked at this with uh, Jason, but wouldn't hard to look at it again. Okay. Good. Amen. The words of the Lord are pure words, as silver tried in the furnace of earth, purified seven times. Thou shalt keep them, O Lord, thou shalt preserve them from this generation forever. That's good. In uh, Matthew 4, 4, we've heard this before, Jesus is saying, It is written, Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of God. That's good. That's good. Tonight I'm preaching on the wordless gospel. Oh, oh. I don't know what that is. It's a, a little book of four pages. Of the black to represent sin, red to represent the blood of Jesus, white to represent salvation, and gold or yellow to represent heaven. And it's recommended by some people to simplify the gospel so you can deliver it to children. Come on. But uh, let's see what the Bible has to say about that. <coughs> Matthew 18, verse 3. That's good. And said, Verily I say unto you, except ye be converted and become as little children, ye shall not enter into the kingdom of heaven. So the gospel doesn't need to be simplified. Jesus said it's simple enough already that a child can understand it. It's good. And, and in fact, you have to become as a child to receive it. Right. It's good. Yeah. I've seen this before. Um, besides the fact that you might have to explain some terms, it's actually easier to deliver the gospel to children. That's right. Exactly. Amen. These, their head has been filled with all these lies and heresy over the years. Yep. Yeah. Amen. 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 And now I want to show you that the word, it's not just better than the colors, it's not just the best way to deliver the gospel, it's the only way. It's absolutely good. the essential way. Right. Uh, right. Justin doesn't have a printer, so I'm reading this off my computer. I'm <laughs> <laughs> uh, We have a bunch of verses, you can try to follow along, but I'm going to do it pretty quick. Acts 4.4, 4, Howbeit many of them which heard the word believed. Amen. And the number of men was about 5,000. That's good. Acts 6.4, but we will give ourselves continually to prayer and to the ministry of the word. Good, Acts eight four. Therefore, they that were scattered abroad went everywhere preaching the word. That's right. That's good. Acts fifteen seven. Oh, that's good. And when there had been much disputing, Peter rose up and said unto them, Men and brethren, you know how that a good while ago God made choice among us that the Gentiles by my mouth should hear the word of the gospel and believe. Amen. That's good. That's good. Ephesians one thirteen. In whom you also yeah. trusted, after that you heard the word of truth, the gospel of your salvation. That's what the gospel of your salvation is, the word of truth. That's right. Amen. Amen. That's good. And I'll go ahead and finish out that verse, because that's good too. Yep. In whom after that in whom also after that you believe, you are sealed with that Holy Spirit of promise. That's good. Right. Amen. First Thessalonians one five. For our gospel came not of you in word only, but also in power and in the Holy Ghost Amen. and in much assurance. That's word good. is in that list, color is not. That's good. right. Amen. <laughs> Romans ten seventeen. So that faith cometh by hearing, and hearing by the word of God. Hey, so, amen. So faith comes by the word of God. That's right. It's good. All right. Let's look at First Peter chapter one. It's good, Scott. <coughs> First Peter chapter one verse number twenty three. Being born again, not of corruptible seed, but of incorruptible, by the word of God, which liveth and abideth forever. Hey, For all sure. flesh is of grass, and all the glory of man is the flower of grass. The grass withereth, and the flower thereof falleth away. But the word of the Lord endureth forever. Amen. And this is the word by which the gospel is preached unto you. Man, that's good. That's right. Amen. All right, now I want to show you one more really important thing about the Word. Let's take a look at the words of the Gospel according to St. John, chapter 1, verse 1. 
John 1 1. Amen. In the beginning was the capital W Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. And down in verse 14, and the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us, and we beheld his glory, the glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. Who's this talking about? Jesus. 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 Amen. In uh, John 10 30, Jesus says, I and my Father are one. Alright, turn to Revelation chapter 19. That's good. Revelation 19, verse 11. And I saw heaven open, and behold, a white horse. He that sat upon him is called, capital F, faithful, capital T, true. And in righteousness he that doth judge and make war. His eyes were as a flame of fire, and on his head were many crowns. And he had a name written that no man knew but he himself. And he was clothed with a vesture dipped in blood. Who is this talking about? Jesus. Jesus. And this is the book of Revelation talking about things that haven't even happened yet? Yeah. And his name is called the Word of God. Amen. 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 It's good. It's good. I'm just trying to establish here that the Word and Jesus and God, they're all one and the same and they're all okay. eternal. Right, man. Yeah. That's, good. That's what we just saw. So, uh, in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God, and the Word still is God, and the Word always will be God. Right. 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 The Word this gospel is a godless gospel. Throw it out. Burn it. It's good. Amen. Yeah. The yeah. only thing you need to get anybody saved, the only thing you can use to get anybody saved, including children, is the King James Bible. Amen. Amen. The Word Amen. of God. I see it happen with my own eyes. It's good. It's good. So, Amen. stop messing with God's Word. Don't Amen. mess with it in a wordless gospel. Don't mess with it in the false book. It's good. Amen. It's, good. it's perfect the way it is. Take right. it or leave it. Amen. It's good. It's good. All right, let's okay. Thank you, God, for this opportunity again to present your word. And um, please be with Richie as he goes to Italy, help him bear some good fruit over there. Amen. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 The Pope drives around behind bulletproof glass. Apparently he's afraid to die, and rightly so, because he's going to hell. <laughs> <laughs>